design and I run a uh, design and make business and we also retail really nice craft. We're also a tea room. Uh, so I work here, uh, Katie works here, who's holding the camera, and so does Scott, for example, of our business admin. Um, and we're planning on having a um, street party down here on the 5th to celebrate Small Business Saturday. So, yeah, come on about 70 plus businesses, uh, mainly um, sort of studio artists um, and why we love working with them is because we end up getting something really really special. We often collaborate with people, um, we often kind of bounce ideas about which is one of the benefits of being a small business and working with other small businesses. Another new maker as well, we were their first stockist is Jodie and this is a special collaborative piece that she's done which is inspired by um, the area that we're in, the lace market. Um, so yeah, I mean again, Jodie's going from strength to strength and we were her first stockist and sort of talking to her about all sorts of things, you know, what they had to charge for her work and value and all those things that small businesses sort of face. Small Business 100 will be, uh, will be amazing. Um, you know, here, us here in the business, myself, Katie and Scott will be really proud to have that recognition. But I think also it would really benefit the small businesses that we work with um, because it'll have that ripple effect of, you know, it's not just us being shortlisted, it's everyone who we work with and do business with. Sometimes where their first stock is. I mean, like Leo, um, she's from Germany, international maker, and where her first stock is in the UK. Um, and it's fantastic. When we showcased her work here, we had a fantastic private view that she was able to attend. And yeah, and, and also Stephen, um, he was actually one of our customers, and we knew him throughout his studies. And um, now he's, you know, where his first stockist and he's doing really well. So, um, but yeah, it's all part of, I suppose, you know, I've been there myself looking for that first break and, you know, we, we have a quite a nurturing approach to kind of the designers that we work with and the small businesses. So when we moved here in 2009, the shop actually was quite small, my studio, which is where we've been filmed from now, is actually um, kind of a really tiny little L shaped. But every sort of six to 12 months, we would expand and sort of much forward. Um, and then about six months ago, we um, we actually walked through and extended our premises uh, to include a tea room and our design studio is now the end upstairs. So we've had a real kind of growth spur, and it's really exciting because it's bringing new people in. And I never actually thought that we would have such a diverse business, but um, you know, when you're kind of in a non public facing area in the city, you know, you, you have to work towards being in, you know, an essential destination, and that's what we really aim to be as a small business. One of the best things about being a small business is that you can respond to new ideas and opportunities. I mean, I can't believe that we've expanded our studio, it's absolutely huge. I mean, this is going to be our office, it's going to be our making, and it's going to be the home to the new Craft Academy, which is a new business venture. Um, it just feels, you know, like this year is going to be a fantastic year. I'm, I'm really excited.